Welcome to the zombie mines, Jesse. <laughs> Just when you think you've seen it all, what exactly is this place? Every few minutes, a million gross zombies spawn. The equally gross prisoners dispatch them and collect the <laughs> zombie flesh, which is... <sighs> gross. I, I get it. But why? Don't know. Don't care. Do your job. Zombies won't fight themselves, so get to fighting. You never thought to question the admin? You don't question greatness, and he is the greatest. For now, at least. You brought this on yourself, Jesse. I don't get it. You could have just joined the admin and never had to suffer a second. <clears throat> Instead, you chose to throw it all in the lava pit. I think all of those people cheering for you 24-7 have made you delusional. Hey, I'm doing the right thing here. I'm the hero. I'm afraid that hero doesn't mean much in the civilized world if you don't have the power to back it up, Jesse. I'll give you one piece of advice. Just one. Try not to cause any more trouble. If you do, you'll get sent to maximum. With her. Who's in there? You must have heard those alarms earlier. That was Prisoner X. She tried to escape, but they got her back. And she... she scares me. You don't want to end up in there. So, play nice. Come along, Luna. Ah. What on earth was that about? Sounds like that vent is our way to Prisoner X. Such a brat, Luna! Come on! <coughs> Ow! Luna, stop that! I'm hitting my llama limit, Luna! Knock it off! She's just not your biggest fan, Stella. I don't get it. I am very deserving of fandom. <coughs> stop bothering me. Don't you see I have important business to tend to right now? Radar, are you okay? That mushroom... It was... intense, huh? No kidding. Standing up to the warden, though? That's my Jesse through and through. Thanks, buddy. But those poor prisoners... No food? Rough stuff. And Stella? Here? We can't catch a break. But first things first. Let's find this Prisoner X and get out of here. Hey guys. Hey. Found anything? <sighs> Nothing of use. Especially since I refuse to look away from those zombie spawners. Don't want any surprises when they go off. Hey. Keep your eyes open. You know, the name of the place has sun and shine in it. And this place doesn't have either. Zombie and despair might be more accurate words. Hey, what is this? Oh, the big guy, Oxblood, was down for a while and headbutted the wall? Not sure why. But man, he has a hard head. We just haven't fixed it yet. There's redstone behind the wall. Hmm, I wonder what it connects to. Gotta be a way in, but this door won't budge. Hey! Don't even bother trying to get in. See those item frames? Only the admin and the warden have the right items. And they could be anything. Besides, why would you want into Prisoner X's cell? That's just bonkers. Stay away. Well, I'm... 
I'm trying to escape, dude. Plain and simple truth. Don't you want to get out of here too? That's, uh, irrelevant. No one escapes. Especially not through that door. Hmm, huh, so that redstone leads to this door. If I can bypass the redstone circuit, I can open the door. Hey guys, over here. What did you find? We need to find something to bypass a redstone circuit and get this door open. This will lead us to Prisoner X. She can help us get out of here for good. Hey, Jesse, stop loafing around. Well, there is someone in here who came from the outside who may still have a hefty inventory. Ah, oh, Stella. You know, Jesse, guests and associates really shouldn't be mingling. Yeah, about that. I, uh, need your help. I need to make a lever. Pronto. Why, exactly? Not that I, you know, really care. You want the truth? I'm trying to escape. As much as I admire you actually telling the truth, there's not a creeper's chance in a cat pack. Not helping you here. No, not risking angering the admin. I had to really prove myself to get this gig as it is. But he's why you're down here, come on! And he is who will help lift me back out again once I finish helping him run this horrible, smelly mud pit. Maybe you make some good points, but not enough of them. I have a place here. Respect. You know, and power, and the, yeah, the works. It's actually very prestigious. Many, many people would love to have this position. Just help me with the lever. There's no way to escape. What could it hurt? Oh, curse your flawless logic. Fine, but don't ever ask me for anything else ever again. That's it for us. No more rivals. No more anything. How many worlds I see, it always seems to come back to levers. Okay, let's do this. Zombie wave incoming! Prepare yourself! Of course. Of course. 
course it's Jesse. Why am I not surprised? Admin? It's not enough that you disregarded all the rules in my icy palace of doom? Tried to upset the delicate order of the Sunshine Institute? Now you're trying to disrupt the therapeutic benefits of my zombie mine? What gives? Pretty sure your fellow inmates were just trying to peacefully live out the rest of their captivities. Well, after you came to Beacon Town and wrecked everything, it seemed like the least I could do. It's terribly rude, is what it is. I'm very disappointed in you, Warden. I, I'm just, I'm, uh, yeah, I'm just a nervous eater. I'm sorry. Ugh, no, not that. I'm disappointed that you couldn't keep Jesse in line for one measly day. I was just trying to do my job, and now I'm in trouble because of you. This job isn't easy to begin with. Why do you have to go and make it harder? Yeah, sorry about that, Warden, but you kind of work for a terrible person. He doesn't deserve an apology, Jesse. Oh, for the love of... Enough! How truly you disappoint me! And that goes for you, and you, and you, and especially you. And as for you... I've been looking for an opportunity for you to prove your loyalty to prove your worth as my champion. Ah! So, unless you want to be added to my naughty list, I suggest you pull out your sword and attack Jesse. And as for you, Jesse, well, don't think I don't believe in fair play. <laughs> now we'll have some real fun. No! I had such high hopes for you, Jesse. The highest of hopes. You could have been my champion. You gave it all away. <laughs> What are you doing? I'm so sorry, Jesse. Are you afraid, Jesse? I'd get over it quick if you are. <laughs> Serious? Ouch! Zip it, Jesse. We only got one shot at this. I'm gonna go to the admin, and then we'll both attack him. Just trust me on this one. Now, Jesse! <laughs> you're, you're joking, right? That's your big idea. Swords can't hurt me. Uh-oh. Oh, all I asked you to do is fight your friend to the death, and you can't even do that. I don't even want you to be my friend anymore. And I don't want you to be my friend either. In fact, as far as I'm concerned, this whole place can burn to the ground. What about Prisoner X? What about all of us? The Institute remains inescapable. So what do I care? I'm leaving. And I'm never thinking about any of you ever again. So I'll just be my own friend now. Can't dwell on the setbacks. Gotta keep looking forward. Do you even listen to yourself when you talk? That made zero sense. To you, maybe. But I don't care what you think. <sighs> I'm going to have loads of friends soon. After all... Everyone loves me.
Jesse, right? No. <gasps> no way. You coming? Good news, Jesse. You're not my rival anymore. Since you're gonna rob down here forever, you're nothing now. Coming, darling admin! Stella is just the beginning. Your other friends will fall in line too. Lucas, Axel, Olivia, all of them. Don't worry, I'll take good care of Beacon Town. <laughs> He's gone. Jesse, we gotta stop him. Oh, Petra. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm so, 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 so sorry. What? No. You have nothing to apologize for. Let's hope Prisoner X is really our ticket out of here.